going on everyone Chappelle Rex here I wasn't gonna do a video on this but there's just a lot to take in and it's just something I really had to talk about it was in the Xfinity race the Martinsville Xfinity race so um second to last race of the Xfinity season and I gotta tell you guys it was it was wild now I like you guys to keep in mind these are only my opinions and my thoughts I do follow the sport pretty closely know a bit more of the ins and outs there's no hate directed towards any parties here around so if you, we're not I'm not gonna do something like that it's just kind of uh they have their own life and they kind of do it um, on track whereas we're kind of we're kind of just sitting back uh, for the ride of watching okay so let's put it this way you have Sheldon Creed Austin Hill and they're both racing for a win and for a title spot so it looks like you have Hill who looks like it's not too bad he's gonna he can lock one in without any without anything going on Sheldon Creed he's in a must win he has to win and for the, you see the laps going on I thought personally I thought myself okay that's he he did what he had to do and it was as clean as it could be. He could have flat out spun the guy out. He could have spun out his own teammate. He could have spun him out and done something like that. But did he? No, he didn't. The he hit him up, just like any any other race. That's what they do. Hit him, um, beat him, bang, and then try to get there. And after the race, there was a lot of people, RCR wise, upset. And they were upset at Sheldon Creed. And honestly, I was actually kind of a little confused. I'm like, all right, well, was there given a different, were they given like an order or something not to do some certain thing or whatever? I don't know. It didn't really make much, it wasn't making much sense to me. And. Uh, as you can see going on like there's a lot going on like when you had RCR like uh, Andy Petrie walking by kind of flipping off parade I'm like whoa like what was like what's going on with that um, Austin Hill who was uh, complain complaining and he's like oh I'm glad um, he won't be here next year don't have to put up with this junk anymore uh, right and then the man himself, and I really, and I do not like this one bit. Even if it was, even if the guy did do it intentionally, or not calling you know, your driver one of the most stupidest people um, around. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, that's not. That is not something that we need um, in this sport like that. I get all parties involved were really angry and upset. Should have given them the space to cool down, but remember, words can carry weight like that, and. In my opinion, that was just—it was just something uncalled for. It was not—it wasn't cool. So you can t kind of tell, like you can be thinking, ah, you know, like maybe Sheldon Creed just a jerk, a prick, something like that. I don't know if you go on if you go on Twitter, and yes, I'm calling it Twitter. You follow along from there, and you kind of see what the garage is talking about, the media are talking about. That's not—that's not really the case. And you've got a lot of people um, calling out at Austin Hill like a bad teammate and all that. And from knowing what I've seen, and I'm going to keep in mind, I've been watching NASCAR for years and years on end. I kind of stopped in between, but um, I, I've still gone on. So I do um, know what I'm talking about in regards to a lot of this. So it's it's just a really unfortunate situation. Even the report, like in the videos, you can see because uh, Hill was saying, "Oh, like we're, like uh, we're buddies, we're good." Even like a couple weeks before, like there was, I guess, an incident they didn't like or something like that. And Hill said, "Oh yeah, you can talk to uh, we're, we're, we're adults. You can go uh, talk to Sheldon about it. It was all good." But then it's like he's almost backtrack and walk those comments. So it's like. Hmm, I don't know. And even when the reporter was trying to say something, he couldn't even give an answer because he asked, he asked Hill about the, um, he was saying like had something um, going on, and Hill's like, no, we've been buddies, and he didn't really give much going off from there. So it's kind of like, okay, that's kind of uh that's kind of really weird. 
So obviously there's something going on that's you not we're not really seeing and all that. I mean, yeah, there's probably a lot of stuff going on behind the scenes and all that we won't know. So, I mean, there's that. But I think mostly can can kind of tell like what Creed's been through with RCR. They've not he's though in the way they treated him lately. It's not good, and this could be said about RCR for going back for a while, like going going back to Harvick, Newman, and, and Hemrick going on there. You know, it's just it, it's not a good look, and I'd really hate it for that because RCR is like one of those not a smaller team, but they're just a legacy team that not really one of the big big dogs out there. So they do got to fight for what what they get too. So everything that just happened is really unfortunate. And going on from here, I don't know. Like if I'm Creed, like fuck, what, what, would I even want to come back to the car next week? Absolutely not. I wouldn't. That's um, it's a joke. That's not. It, it's not. It's not cool either way doing that. So what I think. Uh, should be going on really or what's happening this is just a lot of the change in the landscape of the sport like you had someone like Creed who's uh, really humble he's a good teammate and you can tell with that a lot of the races too if you uh, see them like where they stand from there and all that now as for our Sierra they have uh, another new driver love coming in yeah I'm not sure what I'm not sure what they're gonna expect with that. If you say like oh Hill was saying like oh maybe we could work better together. I don't know. Have you seen how uh, that guy races? So it, it's just it's yeah it's really unfortunate. I think the only person here like really still in the mess is Creed, and that's that's just something that you don't want to you don't want to see like that to be anyone. And I'm gonna put this out. There's one uh, one message uh, because I'm getting really sick of seeing a lot of this um, hate for other drivers out there uh, recently, especially with this season. Like uh, guys are complaining, oh, hate this driver, hate this driver, and all that. Buckle up. Enjoy what you have now. It's gonna be worse. It's gonna be a lot worse. Look what's what's going on in Arca for the past literally couple last seasons. No. So you think it's bad now? Ha. Funny. Buckle up. If you still wanna watch, still gonna watch. Watch what's coming up. Then be concerned. Anyway, if you got a thought opinion, like it down below. Please be respectful in the comments. We all have our own thoughts and feelings and opinions on that. Give me something in there. Thanks for watching, everyone.